Hey there, Pisces! Welcome to your May 2022 general reading with myself, Thomas Yonag. You are watching Thomas's Tower page. Please like, subscribe, and share widely because it helps me to grow the channel. And if you like my work, you can now buy me a coffee on buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. That's buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. Now, Pisceans, let's have a look at your overall energy for the months of May, before we then go into your emotional core, see what's coming in with regards to what can heal, needs to go, um, and maybe love is coming in, or, you know, advice um, regarding love, we'll see, before we then go into the um, opportunities as they present themselves to you in the month of May. Pisceans, are you ready? Bloody awesome, <laughs> because I'm a Piscean too. Okay, you have the great adventure and the voyage of the heart. So what the guides are saying is, um, well, if you are a person that goes like, um, I, I, I feel a bit stuck and maybe going back to something I knew makes me feel at ease, it won't, right? Because you have the great adventure, which means take a risk and that no matter what you do, Pisceans, venture forward. Keep going, stay in your strengths, really, really important because the follow on to the Great Adventure card here, or the picture here, is that you have the voyage of the heart. And the voyage of the heart means that love is coming, if that makes sense, right? Um, so love is coming, and this is not about your emotions yet, but it's understanding, you know, um, because love already flows through us, Pisceans, it's bloody awesome, right? We're going into a month, into a time where we are really operating from an open heart, which is absolutely awesome. Now, remember that we are governed by uh, Neptune and Jupiter, and so... Um, Jupiter is known as the, the best planet there is because all he ever does is bring in, yay, oomph and, um, and positivity. And Neptune is here to open up and bring um, spiritual awareness. So as a sign, Pisceans, we are a super spiritual sign. So now the highest energy that we can create is love. And it is in our overall energy in the month of May to have a loving heart, have a loving sense of being, if that makes sense. But what I'm getting is sort of a word of, of advice. Almost sounds a bit like a warning. And remember, this is a general reading, right? And I'm not here to tell you what you should be doing. But what I'm getting is, and I don't know for who of you this is, but hear me out. What I'm getting is to, to understand that when you rekindle stuff, that hasn't lasted before, there's a good chance it will not work. And the love that you feel about who you truly are should tell you that. Okay, so that was the overall energy for the sign of Pisces, for the, for the month of May 2022. You are watching Thomas's Tower page. This is your general reading. Now, let's go into the emotional core. Now, with regards to emotions, there's not much to add. What the guides are saying is because love is already here, right? If that makes sense. So, so loving energy is already the, the main power that we have for the month of May. And all, all you have to do with regards to how you deal with your emotions is um, to hold the course and stay, stay focused, right? So... Follow what you feel is right, right? Trust that things will be better. Trust that also um, the way they show it to me is there's a relation, there are relationships and, and they probably have become a little bit stale. And so make sure they're going on to another level. And if you're a person that is not in a relationship, then because we had this whole thing about not going back somehow, right? Let go of what you had before, right? Uh, so that you're not manifesting the same crap, if that makes sense, right? Really, really important, okay? I have to say this the way I feel this. Um, this actually feels um, rather awesome, even though there doesn't seem to be all that much happening, if that makes sense. But um, the energy is quite high for us Pisceans in the months of May, which is bloody awesome. Anyway, we have... Um, many less, no, I can't talk. <laughs> Let's look at the um, opportunities as to present themselves to you. And it's interesting because you have miracles, <clears throat> and that basically means, you know, expect wonders, expect the unexpected. Um, 
with regards to opportunities. Okay? Yes. I know everybody's going through the same stuff, right? Rent is higher. Um, gas, gasoline is higher. Petrol is, is higher. You know, um, heating, electricity, everything has been hired. Some of the shelves are empty, right? Do not let this deter you from believing that in the midst of these crises that we're going through, um, right, you will be held by the universe, right? Don't worry about it. It's pointless saying, like, oh my god, this is 75p more expensive. Don't buy it, or buy it and enjoy it more. See, see what I mean, right? Um, yeah, um. There is this phrase that we're all in the same boat, and I get it, people get frustrated. But what I'm getting for us Pisceans, it is pointless getting frustrated. Say to the guides, okay, I'm spending more money, so I want it back, give me more clients, right? That's how I deal with my guides, if that makes sense, because, you know, as they oftentimes remind me, you only work here, so I only work here. I work for spirit, therefore I can say to spirit, look, everything is more expensive, I don't want to hire my prices, send me more clients. Right? Just my example of how to deal with it. And that's what I'm getting for, for all of us, is to, to um, believe in miracles, believe in positivity, if that makes sense, which is also what Jupiter brings to us. Right? And Jupiter is in our sign for the majority of the year. Yes, um, he chickens out for, for, for a month, but I can't remember when. point is, one of our governing planets, <clears throat> Jupiter in that case, is in our own sign. Um, for the majority of the year. So this is a high energy year for us Pisceans, right? So in May 2022, trust that opportunities are coming, trust that you will be cared for, trust that, um, you know, life continues and it won't get any worse, if that makes sense, right? So please, please, please don't be a negative person um, despite all the crap that we have to go through, right? Be positive and share positivity. Really, really important. Pisceans, that's all I got for you for the month of May 2022. Now remember, this is a general reading. It may not resonate with all of you. I hope it does, though. So please, please, please like, subscribe and share widely. Much obliged. See you next time. Bye-bye.